Alright. I'm out. I'm gonna pack okay. this and then we're out. I got fireworks, are you kidding me? Alright, come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Jojo, come on. I'm, uh, I thought I was going it, my bad. La 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 It's uh his new song. Uh, what's what's this called? Uh, pressure. Yeah. Hey. Oh. Oh. Oh, he hit me. That was bad. That was really bad, really bad. No, it wasn't. Oh my god! You good? Oh my goodness. I thought I was gonna die. Bro, earlier when we were playing, my girl was outside. I didn't even know she was outside when she left. Well, she had to go anyway. She just stopped by to see me before she had to go. Uh, two months. She, yeah, she, bro, so basically, like, she met me before I lost my job and everything. And, uh, she just, I'm, I'm glad she's still here, Loki. She's actually pretty cool. I'm not even gonna lie. Huh? Nah, I'm not saying, I mean, most, hey, you'd be surprised, bro. Mo most females do, bro. That's what, um, what's his name was talking about before he left? Um, Spear. He was talking about, uh, I think his ex or something. She was, like, calling him broke and all this homeless stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Like, before I met her, this girl only wanted me to, like, give her attention and whatnot. Like, no, bro, I am not that. I'm not a battery. I can go buy those at the store. But um, with her, like, our first date, I paid. And then every day after that, she's just been paying. She'd be like, oh, don't worry about it. I'm like, bro, I don't I don't need you to do that. Because as a, as a man, you know, you, you want to pay for your girl on a date. You know, not have her pay. But she'd be wanting to split. She'd be wanting to cover. I'm like, dude. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'll be 20 in October, so, I ain't, I ain't tripping on it. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. But I ain't gonna lie though. She seemed like she wanted to stick it out though. Yeah. Well, not everybody because that some of, some of that stuff is hard to come by. Because I mean, coming coming from like you know West Side, the hood and whatnot, you gotta work to get what you want. You know, you can't just you know sit in a room and you know kind of hope for what you want. So it's just like I don't know. She uh. She be motivating me and I be motivating her, so it's just, I don't know. We'll, we'll see how it go. Yeah. That's why I just been kind of, I mean, like, I just been kind of, you know, watch from the distance, you feel me? I, I don't see no red flags so far, and it's kind of weird, because it's like, you're supposed to see them. But, yeah, fair enough. Well, not, no, not, it, no, we've been dating too much. I've known her, like, uh, like, four. What month is it? It's July. I met her around uh, probably February, March. 
She would just see me at my job. I mean, like I said before, once I get this job back, I'm gonna build this brand, and then I'm already doing photography and YouTube, so it's just, uh, I'm trying to, you know, be that guy that y'all just gonna see out doing vlogs and stuff, you feel me, like, like making moves, not, I mean, eh, why not, man, they make money, they make bread, if I can retire my mom, give her whatever, then that's cool, I mean, hey, man, it's, it all come with an idea and a vision, bro. Whoever gonna tap in yeah, while you, you know do it. Do. It's like... It it already starts with you doing it. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Cause, I mean, like the other day I recorded a party. Uh, my homeboy hosts parties and he was like, yo, I want you to bring your camera out, uh, you know, um, sooner or later, I'm gonna try and get you on the production team, get you on payroll. So I was like, ooh, that's actually pretty good. So, we're just gonna see how it go. And then I already have, like, a bunch of people in my family that do business already. So, it's not like I'm out of the loop or anything. But, it's, it's still, you know, some sauce missing. Because not everybody wanna, you know, uphold the sauce. You can do that. Uh... Took my breath away. Ooh. What you do? Yeah, most deaf. You said what? Okay, yeah. Preach, preach, bro. Y'all too, man. Cause it's just, I mean, any, anybody you meet, and really your friends, y'all all just trying to make it out. You feel me? And it's it's it's. it's yeah, you really can. I mean, nowadays, I mean, opportunities are everywhere with, you know, this, this generation. He said, this, he said it's hard to get by, even if, like, you got a job and everything, because everything's so expensive. Yeah. You gotta start somewhere. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's how he did it. Now, now look at him. He got a whole construction company to himself. Like, he owns He gets bread. And he still teaches me, like, Oh, he doesn't wealthiness or whatever, he's not rich. He even said that if we were rich, we'd be living down in probably in the Bahamas. I'm a debtor for the little bit. He said if we were rich, he'd be going all out. Yeah, bro, you're looking to have one, bro. Like, I mean, I got a mom's, but, you know, moms can't really put the, you know, what a dad can give. And that's if, because, you know, some people wish for that. I don't, but some people wish, and I'm like, that's a good I thing. My real dad when I was born. And my oh. dad raised me, my stepdad raised me for like nine years. I mean, I was there when I was just two, so I, I count them as. Did you remember your real one when you was four? Oh, that was cool. I still have his PS. I need that Max. I need that. I don't trust anyone because of what happened to him. Like I have really bad trust issues after what happened to him. Yeah, man. That's how I be, but you can't really hold, can't hold it in like that. Exactly. Looks like. He got set up by his friends because he was supposed to go over and like chill out. Because they like biking and stuff, drink, whatever, mm -hmm. like going out. One of them was real. He didn't even know like the plan was happening. One of them didn't even know what was happening. And he tried to stop it. So basically, one of the friends didn't like my dad. Right. And so basically, what he did was he set my dad up to go like to his house one day. 
Gotta, you gotta, you gotta look at it as like you just gotta watch who you cool with. You gotta, you just can't put everything out there, and then you know just it, it's gonna hurt and it's gonna be tough. But, you know, it's just a part of growing up. You feel me? And you know, you being younger than me, it's like, hey man, you know, just hang in there. Yeah, bro. Yeah. It, it's it's kind of hard to come by, but at the same time, it's like once you get it, you can't lose it. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. Well, but, you know, there's also the point that, you know, family could also be at risk, too. Because it's like, you could be doing, you could you could have better ideas and do way better than your family. And then, you know, they want a piece of that. And it's like, nah, you didn't show me. And then when I asked for help, you didn't give it. So once I got it, why do you need it? So it's just, you got to also be careful about it, too. Cause it's like I have a sister, you know, and I have a, you know, I Mhm. Oh, Philly. I do. I got to tie it on me. I worry my body. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. Exactly. And you can you can't really heal a, per a fixed person. You can only show them the way, and yet if they follow. Because and don't let and don't let him hurt you. Don't let him hurt you. Like don't be somebody who gets you know sad or mad all the time or angry because somebody hurts you. Right. You gotta be a better person. You gotta be a better person. Exactly. Better person is the end goal of the day. Because at the end of the day, you just want to be the best person you can be. Make sure you can support yourself and then do what you want to do. Yeah, for your family. Yeah, bro. Because at the end of the day, you know. If it's just you, if you don't got family, if you don't got friends, you got God. So it's just, you gotta find something that. Hey, that's good, man. Yeah, bro, because a lot of them can be, whew. A lot of them can be, yeah. They just want your mom. Yeah, bro. That's why I'm so skeptical. Like, look, my, my mom blind, bro. Like, my dad, my dad really understood me, though, because he, my stepdad, he uh, understood me a lot because he would, um, he lost his, uh, he didn't know his real dad. 
so